Here's a letter to the Prime Minister I won't talk policies, I put anthrax in it just to finish ya My people's blood stain machete that I swing at ya I don't got paper but I jam more than a printer does And when I do I only speak on real issues Sour grapes so I replace the warheads with some real missiles And I will get you put a bomb in parliament So at question time I add fire to the argument Head kick Miss Gillard like Crow Cop She's another gerbil up the arse of Rupert Murdoch Soldiers in the street waiting on the word Not the next rigged election We're invading her block Storming Canberra with rags on like this was for turf RPGs on the roof of the Federal Reserve Your pie in the capital is what we want right now Fly the flag at half mast upside this down To the PM We can, we will take back the reins My letter to the PM we can, we will leave the flag in flames This my letter to the PM We can, we will take back the reins My letter to the PM We can, we will leave the flag in flames Yeah, fuck a letter to the PM This is a death threat, revolution coming That'll be your best bet So don't worry about standing down, they might replace you But we'll replace the replacement and assassinate you Then we'll take you and bury you in the MT In the radiation waste dump that your MPs Rape the land with, feeling fed up And I know that so are the people that I take a stand with They don't really give a fuck about us or the planet It's time we take our freedom now Sick of hearing you demand it All this activism and what's the outcome You vote for the next promise maker, not our ones I see you voting on the best of two hypocrisies Whose policies operate to serve this plutocracy So it's time to end the 1% monopoly Cause 99% say fuck the government with this me my letter to the PM We can, we will take back the reins My letter to the PM We can, we will leave the flag in flames This is my letter to the PM We can, we will take back the reins My letter to the PM We can, we will leave the flag in flames Yeah Liberal and Labour are two sides of the same coin Why do we believe their promises? They lie and we act like we didn't see it coming So come next election, who are you gonna vote for? I wonder which hypocrisy will look better in the eyes of the Australian people I mean seriously, wake the fuck up